Yo, 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 what is going on guys? It is your boy Optic Scumpy. Just got a little bit of a warm-up game in there. Playing some Black Ops 3. It's double XP weekend and you guys know what that means. If you guys aren't grinding, I'm mad at you. Right now, I got 60... 59 crypto keys just had a 47,000 XP game. We're gonna be playing on some combine basically last night. I messed up um, I did something that I don't usually do I try to avoid doing it for this obvious reason and the obvious reason is that I slept until 4 p.m. Today um, it's dark outside you guys can see that It's dark outside I woke up an hour ago, took a shower, um, that's pretty much all I got to do, and now it's already dark outside, so I'm pretty pissed off at myself, I don't like to sleep the day away, I hate being unproductive, especially on a double XP day, that just gets right under my gears, but not all things are negative from last night, I grinded so much that I got my diamond ARs, um, it probably took me about two or three days of grinding, I'm going for the dark matter camo, um, so every single time that I get diamond, you guys are going to be seeing a video like this one, where I basically go through and play a game with every single diamond gun that I got, so we're going to be going through all seven of the ARs, um, well, maybe going through all seven of the ARs, depending on how many times I actually die. Because if I don't die seven times, then we're not going to get through all the ARs, because I have a different class for all of the ARs. But yeah, got the diamonds. On my way, to get Dark Matter, you have to get diamond on every single subclass in the game. So I've done the SMGs, and I've done the ARs. I'm probably about three-fourths of the way done with the shotguns as well. So I got that done last night too, and that guy's going to escape. Hopefully he falls off, which he probably will because it is hard to wall run. Oh, uh, no, he didn't fall off. But I gr I got so much done last night, dude. I'm almost done with this, uh, the diamond shotguns as well. So you're going to be seeing a video like this one for the shotguns, which should be no fun at all because the shotguns have completely ruined my KD. Uh, I'm probably sitting at around a 2.6 right now. And I was sitting around a 2.8 whenever I started doing these challenges. So, you can probably tell, these things are going to completely destroy your KD, by the way. If you're going for these challenges, if you're going for these camos on your guns, you got to throw your KD out the window. Your score per minute won't really change that much, I don't think. But your KD, it's going to take a severe drop. Because going for headshots um, on shotguns, that shit is just tough. You know, it's not, it's not easy. And doing that for a long time, it's really... It's, this camo is not for the faint of heart. It's for grinders... You got to straight grind for this camo if you really want it. There's there's no if ands, or buts about it. You really got to dedicate yourself to getting this. And I think that I got in one of the newbiest, the most noob-filled lobbies that I've been put in in a very long time. So this is something that I am very excited about. I haven't got put into a noob lobby in a while. But the only downside to this is is my score streaks aren't that good for this. I mean, I have UAV, counter UAV, and Hellstorm, and that's just so I can level up. I mean, those are the best for leveling up because you get them the most often. They get you more points in the game. Those are the best for leveling up, so that's what I decided to throw on. I didn't really think that I was going to be going for a high kill gameplay, but I might as well try now, you know? This guy's about to shit on me. Okay, he was pre-aiming that specific thing. Don't you dare. Don't you dare spawn kill me like that. I don't know how I just killed that guy, but I'm not going to argue it. Zah! That guy too. They're all in our spawn. I, I'm i going to go out on a limb here. I don't like combine. I don't know about you guys. I, I just I don't like this map because for this very reason, it's so spawn kill oriented. You can't do anything if you're on the team that's getting spawn killed. Like You have to try and fight your way out of the spawn. And it can get so hard sometimes. I don't know. I just think that this map is so damn small. Compared to the rest of them, this map is tiny. So whenever you play it, if you're getting spawn killed, it's so hard. Now, I, I'm not going to say I don't actually... I don't not like... You know, I'm not saying I don't like it like that. Like, I don't know. It's probably, it's probably just one of my least favorite pub maps. Because it is so difficult sometimes to keep my cool... When I'm just getting spawn trapped for a full game. It's just sometimes it can be so stressful. But it's fantastic if you're on the team that's doing the spawn trapping. Don't get me wrong. That can be a lot of fun. So we got some counter UABs. UABs here. I'm going to throw those out. Hopefully help my teammates out a little bit. Dude, these guys like aren't even playing. So I'm not really sure what's going on with them. I don't think none of the other people. None of the other 
team have prestige yet. I feel bad. Like, I'm probably ruining their experience right now. They were hopping on today. They were like, hell yeah, man. Double XP, bro. Let's get it. That's probably what they were thinking at the start. And then they get into this lobby and they just start getting absolutely destroyed. And they're probably, th they're having second thoughts about playing today. They're turning off their consoles. They're going to do something better with their lives. Which there is nothing better to do with your lives because Call of Duty is life. I'll say it time and time again. Cod is life, baby. Cod is life. But here we go. Hellstorm after Hellstorm. I'm only getting one kill per though. The Hellstorms in this game are pretty weak. Not gonna lie. They're pretty, pretty weak. They're pretty scrawny. Just picture old buff scump. Hellstorms are the new scump. Haha, <laughs> I know a lot of you guys love that one. And I've been I've been stuck on the Shiva here for a while. I can't seem to die with this thing. Not that I'm trying to die with it, but I cannot seem to get it out of my hands right now. Is there a guy? I think this guy's camping back here. He was. What a weenie. Good thing my teammate took him out. I know that I have the hive available right now. But I don't know how to use it. So I'm just going to hold on to it. I have no idea how to use the hive. I mean, I do. You shoot it and you get kills. And actually, I just called it my counter. You made a pretty bad time. We're going to switch guns here. I'm not just going to use the Shiva the whole game because I want to I want to show you guys the rest of them. But I, it's just I play so aggressive, the hive. If you shoot them at the ground and they're, you know, buzzing around, you're going to get kills with them. But if you die, they go away. So I'm like sprinting at people and dying every second. So it, I never get kills with them. But we're going to move on to the next gun here, like I said. The XR2. I don't know if I want to move on to this just because I'm on a nice streak right now, you know? I'm, I'm on a nice streak. I don't just want to die. And I'm probably going to die with the XR2. Let's be real. The Shiva's OP. The Shiva's too good, man. This XR2 better... It better be good. Oh, my goodness. It's, if this thing gets me killed, I'm going to be one salty Seth. One salty little carrot I will be. But I'm going to play this like a little little weenie. I'm going to play this like a weenie real quick. This guy's wall running and shit. He's doing all that he can. He's lagging. He doesn't know what's going on on his screen. I'm going to actually call this in. Because I want to clear out this lane so I can actually push up. Yep, there's one. There. Okay, there we go. Now I can push up. Hopefully there's not another one here, which would be a vibe kill. But now I can push up. Here we go. Now we're good. No, 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 no. Kill him. Teammates, teammates, help me, help me. Please don't let me die to him. There's a guy up in that window. Don't you open up that window. All right. We're going to actually just hold this riverside. Sheesh. This is what I like to call kill streak alley right here. The riverside of the map. Oh my gosh. I'm so weak. Oh my gosh. Dude, this is getting, this is getting intense. Fuck. See, that's why I didn't want to pull out the XR2. If I had the Shiva right there, I'm getting that kill. That guy's not killing me right there if I have the Shiva out, but it's okay. The purpose of this gameplay is to not get the the most kills in the... I mean, it is, but not to get the most kills, but to show off all of the guns. So really, I want to die seven times, and no, I don't. I'm just using that as a complete excuse. Oh my gosh, teammate. So that if I do die, it doesn't make me look as bad. We're on the last gun here, though, the M8. Let me know what you guys think of the diamond camos, though, dude. I don't know. I don't know. I think I like the Black Ops 2 ones better. Uh, I've gotten that response from a lot of people, especially in my live stream. A lot of people have been saying that they like the Black Ops 2 ones better. And I don't know. I might feel the same, sort of. Because these, like, I like them, but I feel like they're not, they're not as good because Dark Matter is out there, bro. It's like, Dark Matter is out there. It is... Wait a second. Are you good, bro? I don't know what was wrong with him. That fool was... He was struggling right there. But Dark Matter just makes it seem like the diamond is not the best camo in the game. Which it's not. Because there is something that is above diamond. Technically speaking, on the scale of camos. I mean, Dark Matter is going to be absolutely insane. I can't wait to get it. But I think that I like the Black Ops 2 diamond a little bit better. But we're going to control this Riverside once again. You're going to see a trend here. I feel like I'm running a cooking show. Like, you wanna, you wanna go here, you wanna sit here, preheat your oven at 450 degrees. Basically what I'm doing here, trying to help you guys out. This riverside is just so clutch, you like, you'll never die. Oh, and this is where you start to die whenever you go away from the river. Stay near the river. You wanna stay near the river at all times. That guy just fell off the map, he's a wang. 
I'm gonna hellstorm these people once again. I wish that I had my wraps on right now because if I had my wraps on or something like that, I'd be getting stupid kills. I would have been getting stupid kills this game. Dude, I've gotten three kills with my hive. That's literally the most kills I've ever gotten with one set of hives ever in my whole career on Black Ops 3. I'm not kidding either. I don't know how to use the things. I hate them. I don't hate them, but it's definitely my least favorite thing. Now we got some people trying to creep up Riverside, and I just bombed the top of the building, which wasn't the smartest idea. Holy stuns. Please don't stun me again. I beg you. Right, cleared them out. Gonna get back over here to River. Looking good. Oh shit! We got Robin Hood in the in the building. We got two Robin Hoods in the building. Holy one burst though. That one burst. He is heated. 52 and five. I'm having a good score line. Good KD game at least, but not the highest kill game. Oh, I'm beating people down. Come here. Come here, man. Oh, shit. I'm beating people down out here. I don't even need my gun anymore. Come on. Quad to end the game. Quad to end the game. Quad to end the game. Fuck. Didn't quite get what I wanted there. So I went 55 and 5 right there, guys. I need to fix my overlay, actually, because you can't see deaths. But I went 55 and 5. Trust me. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. Trust me. You guys got to trust me on this one. I'm at 55 and 5. We'll see if the scoreboard at the end of the game can show you guys. All right. Let's see how much XP total we got. 42,000 from that game. Scoreboard. There we go. 52 and 5 for you guys right there. Nemesis killed me one time. Bowman and Eagle, you son of a gun. I want to thank you guys, though, for tuning into today's video. I hope that you did enjoy it. If you did, dropping a like really helps out the channel. I'd very much appreciate it. And as always, guys, this was your boy, Scumpy of Fire.